Good morning. It is day four of our of our trip, final morning. We just woke up, had a shower. That's the shower. Got changed. Um, it's about quarter past six in the morning. It's already 33 degrees. We had a pretty good sleep last night. I took some sleeping pills. Best decision ever. It was super windy, uh, really hot, but but we got through it. And now the sun's coming up. Ooh, don't know where you can see it. Over there, maybe. We'll go have a look. Um, so today we're gonna eat some breakfast, and then about seven o'clock we're gonna head off to the the deepest part of the Danical Depression, which is 120 meters below sea level, in a place called Dalal, where the sulfur lakes are, and where uh, all the colorful stuff is, so it should look pretty awesome. What? Right, let's check out this sunrise. We just reached one of the deepest points of the depression, 118 meters below sea level. Yeah, I've seen the. Oh, sorry. <laughs> and the the color of the salt's changed again. It's gone to like a reddy color now. And it's really hot. It's a bit humid today. No wind, which is nice. But we're going to walk up over the hill to see the sulfur fields. So hopefully, they're supposed to be really colorful and awesome. The white bits here are all full of salt. But like the red bits there have iron, and then the yellow bits are the are the sulfur. So over the back there, over there somewhere I can hear you can hear something bubbling. So I assume that's a little little sulfur pits. The earth is cooking. Never been to Mars, but I expect it to be a lot like this. Our footage. The drone is full. 
It survived the heat. We are officially in the deepest part of Ethiopia, the lowest part of Ethiopia, the Dalal Lake. It was all part of the Danakil Depression. It's about 120 meters below sea level. It's the third lowest part on earth behind the Red Sea and a place in Egypt, I think. I'm not too sure. I'll research it and I'll put it up on the screen. But it is something else. Salt Lake, so I'm shaking a bit because it's so hot. It's just incredible. Look at this. You just imagine what it would have been like a million years ago when it was still the Indian Ocean. All the craters and crevices where the water would have been. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. These are all the salt mountains, just from millions of years of deposits and wind. We got lucky today because there's no wind, but that means the humidity is at about 99% and it is stifling hot. Right now, I am most likely, literally, the lowest person on earth. Incredible. 120 meters below sea level in the Dalal Lake in the Denikal Depression. It's too hot. Time to get back into the cars where the AC is running and actually feels like you can be a human for a bit. It's freaking amazing. Now we're hardly surviving. It's just it's hard to it's hard to describe. Like it's like another world. It is like you see. Like the rocks, the colours you don't see anywhere else. It's like think of like a like an old like an old car that's sort of been sat on the side of the road and it's all started rusting and that, there's that red sort of like worn out tinge to it. And that's the whole place. The whole place looks like that, just from natural minerals coming through from the ground. And then the heat and now we're in some and then all of a sudden there's just mud. <laughs> so you have to be careful wherever you walk. But I'm very happy we did it. Yes, very happy. <laughs> Highly recommend it. We're just on the edge now. Four days is enough. Three days was enough. <laughs> yeah. Four and is... We know we have to uh, film and photograph everything. So we're pretty exhausted. Yeah. We're going to sleep in some nice hotels tonight. <laughs> tonight we're living it up. Just for we're one just night. Gonna splash. <laughs> we need a shower and a soft bed and AC. Oh, yeah. uh, but the town will be a bit cooler. So looking forward to that. But we'll see you somewhere else. Why? Forgot to take my phone for this bit. And we just stopped by a little sulfur lake. Uh, it's all bubbling stuff look really cool. It's all bubbling away. Full of sulfur. So this is what's underneath all the salt fields. <laughs> so now I'm at the, our final stop for our four-day trip. We're at the salt mine. It's about. 39, 40 degrees, and these guys are out here in the sun every day making salt cubes. Apparently, they sell for about five burr, which is about 25p. Unbelievable. Just finished our last little lunch stop, and now we're gonna head back to Michele for the end of our trip. It's been freaking awesome.
go back to Mekele. Our trip to the depression is done. Four days in the hottest freaking place on earth. Feeling fresh. Here's we our. Need to see Baiton, our favorite guy. Our, our favorite drivers. Eob. Oh, <laughs> Goodbye. Bye -bye. Thank you too. That's our guide and our driver. They've been awesome. Hi, Luke. What is it? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Not yet. One another day. As soon as you are <laughs> All right, we'll leave it there. For the Danico depression, back to McKelly. See you later. And how you doing? Good. We're shitting ourselves. Our guy's just running along the edge. <laughs>